Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another how to landscape vlog series for beginners. We are uh, here today talking about audio. I just want to let you know you don't have to spend a lot of money to get great audio, but you do have to get some sort of microphone for your setup. I started out with my Sony a7 III internal audio and it sounded okay. I mean, it's just, it, it'll get you by, but if you really are taking this seriously, you're going to have to step up to some uh, external audio options. So the first thing I got was actually this lab mic here, but Here's another one I got right here. Uh, my cat chewed it. But yeah, I got this and my cat decided to chew it, so I had to buy another one. But these are uh, only uh, $16.99, I think. And uh, I mean, you can hear the audio now. You can let me know if it sounds good or not. Um, but yeah, so when I first got a mic, I just got the lav mic and uh, figured I could use that out in the field too. But that didn't work out because the first time I went out there, I knocked my tripod over three times and I just quit. I was like, this isn't going to work because I know I'm going to mess my camera up or break a lens or something. So I stepped, well, I didn't step up, I sidestepped to this. This is the, uh, the Movo VXR10. I think this costs thirty-five dollars, so not bad. But where is it actually? Let me grab it. So here you go. Yeah, this one it's like thirty-five bucks. Uh, just a tiny little shotgun mic. It, it works great. Does pretty well. It's not the best in high wind, but you know any microphone is not going to be great in high wind. One of the reasons why I really like this Movo is it has no batteries. There's nothing to forget. You just plug it in and it works. This one was only thirty-five bucks. The lab was only sixteen. 17 bucks. So there are some cheap options out there. Uh, you don't have to spend a ton of money to get great audio, but you definitely have to have some external audio if you're uh, taking this seriously at all. Um, it really helps people hear and stay engaged with your content. So absolute necessity to pick up if you're doing a, you know, landscape photography vlogs uh, is a microphone. So something you should get. I just want to let you know, you got to have decent audio, but you don't have to spend a bunch of money to get it. There's uh, options out there, especially these days for, you know, next to nothing. So we're not doing award-winning documentaries. You just, have, you just have to have decent audio so that people can hear your videos. And, uh, and there are cheaper options, but I did my research on this and this seems to be the one that everybody likes in this price range. And it's worked great for me so far. Um, I do a little bit of post-processing with uh, EQ compression, but it sounds pretty good straight out of here. So you don't have to have amazing audio, but you do got to get something. And uh, these options have been working great for me so far. So yeah. So I just want to say, get out there, create more content, explore more, and uh, share your journey with the world. I can't wait to see the videos everybody makes. I love watching everybody's different takes, how they shoot and everything. So it's been great being in the community here and YouTube and seeing how everybody does things differently and pulling the things you like from people. And it's just been great. So I just want to say thanks for everybody. I appreciate you accepting me here to this YouTube photography community and I uh, look forward to what everybody's making. All right, guys. See you later.